Welcome to Eternal Mana, the daily devotional broadcast of Grace Gospel Church. Today we are looking at Philippians chapter 4 and verse 15. Moreover, as you Philippians know, in the early days of your acquaintance with the gospel, when I set out from Macedonia, not one church shared with me in the matter of giving and receiving except you only. Uh, I don't know how you look at that verse, but uh, I uh, look at it with profound sadness. You can uh, kind of detect some pain in Paul's voice. He is highly complimenting the Philippian church that they supported him over and over again financially with gifts. And then he says, you were the only church who stood by me. Now, there were other churches that Paul had founded. But for some strange reason, they did not support Paul. Now, that uh, forced me to ask the question, why is it that today churches do not give? to help in the cause of Christ, to help support missionaries. Why? Why is it that churches do not give? So I have uh, listed five reasons. There certainly could be many more, but here are five reasons uh, as to why I think uh, churches uh, are defaulting in this whole matter of giving. Number one, the lack of resources the lack of resources. So a church may say, oh, we are struggling and uh, we are hardly able to uh, make ends meet. Uh, we struggle to pay all our bills and uh, how can we now be supporting uh, missionaries and uh, the work of God, lack of resources. Uh, the answer to that is, God multiplies our resources. Remember the feeding of the 5,000? Five loaves and two fishes when offered to the Lord in the hands of the Lord. They are multiplied and unbelievable number of people were fed. So when we choose to give out of our poverty as it were, God will multiply. Secondly, and this is a more dangerous uh, reason as to why churches don't give, indifference. Indifference is where we uh, say, uh, you know, I don't care about it. I don't care about missions. I don't care about the lost. I don't care about people going to hell. Uh, it's just our little church, Kumbaya group. That's what matters. Indifference. Indifference is a sin that needs to be repented of. Number three as to why these churches may not have given is because of assumption. Oh, the other church will take care of it. The other church will take care of Paul. We don't have to bother. We assume. We assume that others are giving. And so why should I give? Why should our church give? So that's a dangerous assumption to go on, assumption. Number four uh, is a uh, practical reason, ignorance. I was not aware. I didn't know that uh, the apostle had needs, uh, that this mission organization has needs. I didn't know. So that's why today there are a lot of missionary newsletters that go out digitally. I get quite a few of them. I process them, pray over them, and see what I can do to help, right? And uh, from Sri Lanka, we get so many requests asking for help. We can't help everyone, but we have to do our part. So uh, we can't plead ignorance because in this digital age, there is so much of information made available to us. And... Uh, the reason number five as why churches don't give is plain disobedience. Plain disobedience. 
the Lord has clearly taught us in the scriptures that we are called to give, to give sacrificially uh, to the promotion of the gospel. And we disobey. And, uh, and disobedience is sin. So these are five reasons that I uh, jotted down. There could be more, as I said. But I want you to look at them at a very personal level and uh, see where we are failing. And uh, will we make a decision today that uh, we will not be like the other churches who did not support Paul, but that we will be there in the forefront, as it were, to uh, be able to help in the way that we can and watch how God is going to multiply resources and cause his work to expand and grow in unbelievable ways. Amen. For more videos like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, Grace Gospel English Church Toronto. Thank you.